but I'd still like to echo the comments made by colleagues from across the chamber, uh, first and foremost, because outlined by them already, it's clear that the executive team on the University of Cadwell, the University Health Board, are clearly not delivering on the aims of both the Welsh Government or were delivering on the aims uh, of the independent members uh, of, of the board. They're continuing to fail, the people of North Wales, and we cannot continue to see this uh, happen. And, and as be aware, as already been highlighted, we, we are probably 10 years down the line now uh, of, of, of these consistent failures, eight years of which uh, would have been in special measures, if the special measures would have uh, continued as they uh, should have done. And it's no exaggeration when we talk about this being a life and death situation. People's lives are on the line um, with the health service in North Wales. It's my residents' quality of life uh, that are suffering as a result of poor management of the health board in North Wales. It's my residents I care about most in this situation. And Minister, you mentioned that you don't have have, uh, you don't believe that the levers that you need to be able to make the changes that you uh, want to see. So I'd be interested to hear when you think you may uh, get those levers that you need um, and your capacity as health minister to, to rectify uh, this poor uh, situation. And in addition uh, to this, Minister, it's clear that politicians from across the political spectrum want to work with the health board to improve the situation for our residents in North Wales. We don't want to stand up here uh, week in, uh, week out, saying how bad things are. We want to stand here and be proud of the health service that we have uh, in North Wales. We want to see change happen desperately for our residents in North Wales. So, Minister, how do you believe we can work more closely together to better serve our residents, not just through scrutiny and challenge in this chamber, which we continue to do and seemingly continue to be ignored as we highlight the issues that we see in North Wales? Please. So, what structures uh, do you think could be put in place to better enable us as locally elected members to support and scrutinise the work of the board to help see the change uh, that we all want to see. Jo Williams.